All of you are well aware that what happened in 2020 and 2021. How terrible a year that was and how terrible the year this is going to be. None other than coronavirus has affected everybody. Yeah, you are much aware of that. I just want to clear some things with you. Who is the most affected person during lockdowns? Who is the most affected person when everything is running smoothly but they are not i just want to question you i just want to ask you why why they are so much of it why every can everyone couldn't be stable why the help can't be provided to them also why the union budget doesn't include them and their finances their provisions when the lockdown curbs were imposed, their shops were closed. Their factories had been shut down. They were forced to leave their workplace. They paid their workers, though they had to pay. They had no choice. All the government workers were paid well. They were due on the work, but they were paid well. Though the government cut 30% of their salary, but they weren't much affected. The one who earned 2000 during normal, price, normal conditions were unable to earn even 200 rupees in coronavirus crisis. I want to tell you some truths about world trade and effects of coronavirus on it. UK, the Indonesia it left OPEC because of no one was buying their oil. No one was importing oil from these countries during 2020. They burnt their oil due to excessiveness of oil and other petroleum and other non-natural reserves. It was wasted. And now, they are the most peaceful country. They are still earning though. Their national income is still high. Why India is behind? USA, the most affected country by coronavirus, is still, on the, is still a superpower, is still great in wealth. They had elections though, but it, un it wasn't slightly affected by coronavirus. Why developed countries are still developed and developing countries are much on underdevelopment? Why India has been given the status of partial freedom? The simple answer is lack of force to support businessmen, traders and millionaires in the country. I take no names but I am urging and requesting everybody to, to make the government here, the actors here, the politicians here that businessmen require your support. Make some provisions for them, help them and they will help the nation grow. Thank you.